Can't see much from here. Come on. I'm glad you didn't have to see that happen. Keep moving. Here's the food. Clem, this formula. Bonnie was right. Greenhouse is in good shape. You know, maybe we should stay here a while. See how it goes. Just, just stay behind me. Clem. They don't look armed. This your place? It's big. Go away. Uh, all right, wait a second. Just hear me out. We need help. My boy, he... He ain't doing so good. What's wrong with him? Look, uh, don't worry. He ain't, uh, he ain't bit. Just hungry. We've been walking for weeks. Ran out of food a couple days back. That's your kid? Where you girls been? Why do you care? Whoa, I, I didn't mean nothing by it. Step away from the fence, please. Keep your eye on him. This place needs a lot of work. Yeah? Ah, uh, we could help you. There's not that much food left. Please. We won't make it another night out here. <laughs> Look, I know you don't know us, and I know a lot of people out here say a lot of things. But I'm asking you, as a father, please don't turn us away. I don't know, Clem. It could be anybody. Do we really want to go through this again? Please. Leave. What? You heard me. Now. Please. Don't do this. Are you sure you want to do this, little girl? I mean, what if... What if we're dangerous? What if I am? Come on, honey. Let's go. Thanks for doing that. After looking at that kid, I wasn't sure if I could. But we had to. We have to look out for ourselves now. Sometimes, you have to hurt someone else to protect the people you care about. A friend told me that once. They might come back. Then we'll be ready.